let the games begin. Hey, hey, you ready? Welcome back to Prey. In the last set, we explored a lot of the power plant and got blocked by a plot wall, I suppose. And so we decided to make our way to the Arboretum. There's a door to it. I'll be going through this door and I'll be sparing you the loading screen as per usual. I'll see you on the other side. Now supposedly the Arboretum is dedicated to creating an Earth-like environment for relaxation and reflection. Work. Yes? The entrance to deep storage is off the Arboretum. Okay. Your brother's office is up here as well. Jupiter is to take a look palace at, at the top of the heavens. He used to oh say boy. that behind his back. Oh but that would make boy. you... What? Neptune? Pluto. God of the Dead? Eh, it's not bad. Where's my helmet of invisibility? Or whatever Hades used. Hades, I believe, was Pluto. Um, Zeus was Jupiter, and I don't know the rest. Mars was God of War. You quit that! Ugh. It was a waste. Jia Kyung Ho. Whatever your name is. Officer Jia, this is Chief oh, Elazar. Jia here, Chief. How can I help you? I need you to report to There's deep storage everywhere. and get Chief Show to reactivate the tracker on Grant Lockwood. Hmm. HR deactivated it as part of the termination, hmm. but we don't have a record of him on the departing shuttle. I want to know where he is. And you assume and he'd still be wearing it. Where he needs to go. On it, Chief. You think they could just remotely deactivate it or whatever? Actually, wouldn't they remove and deactivate it after they've um, taken him on the shuttle back home? I mean, that'd be a bit uh, better practice. They should just have a station on Earth like um, a Talos or whatever trans uh, transcribe or trans star uh, station on Earth that serves as an outlet, you know, like an airport, where they just decommission them there. It would be easier to do. I mean, that's a big security flaw. Then again, they have exposed wires on their doors, so I don't know what I'm talking about. Making stuff. Do I need a... Uh, maybe I should do a little bit of uh, refinement. No, no, no. I, I, I'm probably all right. I just need to remember this area. At least... Nope, they do not have Typhon material in them yet. When you eat eels, they give you back some of your uh, side points. Which I thought was interesting. Then again, um, supposedly people have side points anyway, just a very small amount. So maybe it's not all type of- What is with all this noise? Holy moly! Morgan, are you alright? That Typhon, there's nothing in the research. Yeah, I know. Stay away big. from it. What the hell was that? A freaking Typhon gorilla? Jeez. Stupid monster. Well, all this looks expensive. Jeez. Those must be fake finds because there's no light for them. But they're genetically engineered. Mark Sellers, instead of carrying around a baseball glove, shouldn't you carry around something that would protect your life? I wonder people like that. Hello? While you're up there, you could look into why the lift is stuck. It'd be a lot faster and safer than having to fly through the guts again. Maybe. Why? Are you saying the guts are going to repopulate? Filled with parasites. Who's that? Who turned out the lights for a second? Uh, I don't like this place. Ugh, weird. I like this place a whole lot less than the rest of the ship. I mean, or whatever. This place kind of weirds me out. Ooh. I mean, it's kind of cool and neat, but at the same time... I don't feel as safe here as I did in the rest of the station. There we go. I called it a ship. Mm. I could force that door open where that thing ran down, but I'm kind of loath to fi Oh, oh, that's fertilizer. I wonder if I could have stuck that um, psychic injector into the fertilizer tube, because it looks about the same. Formula testing approved. Entry 165. I managed to reduce the growth time to around 10 minutes per fruit. It's remarkable to see them sprout from practically nothing and grow to an edible size and ripeness before my very eyes. More importantly, I finally obtained clearance for wider range testing of the growth formula from Dr. Kelstrup. And that's left 
all that's left is actually fabricating it and then inserting it into the sprinkler system. I'm keeping the fabrication plan on my person, as I doubt others would, or as no doubt others would love to claim credit for it. Dr. Julian Howard. That's weird. Wouldn't that cause issues? Forcing something to grow that quickly, that, I don't know, that would cause something, I don't know. I should stop saying I don't know so much. But I really don't. Usually when things grow that fast, they suffer issues. The hell was that? I'm hearing weird noises. It's giving me anxiety. Ooh, what's that? There's a mimic in there. I can hear you. Oh, it's probably the med kit. Yeah, it's the med kit. It moved. Oh. I didn't like that I knew what it was. Eh, might as well open this. Oh, it's just that it sees me. All right. Fine, whatever. You can be horrible and spidery all you want. I'm still gonna shoot you. You may forget, I have a shotgun. Boop! I mean, really. It's just that simple. Oh, I thought that was a face. Final approval. Julian stopped by, but you were out. FYI, reviewed your lab notes. Plants pose no health risk. You should be good to go in Arboretum. Hans. Interesting. That'd be kind of cool. I want a tomato. Ten minutes later, tomato! So, the food items are making that weird collision noise. Hmm. Doesn't seem to be anything else in the high row. Uh, high rows. Yeah, those are alright. I thought I said something wrong. Right, there might be humans around here because I heard a noise. If there are humans, I need to learn, or I need to be able to subdue them without murdering them because odds are they're going to be mind controlled. Edna Burton. Why do you use that recycler grenade to protect me? Excuse me? Hmm. Oh, this is how it works. That's really cool. No, not Psychoshock. Backlash, no, no, no. Mind Jack! Hmm. You don't want to evolve? What if I don't want to leave you alone? You need to be enlightened. Hey! Hey, over here! Open this door! Okay. I'm guessing if I watch the entirety of his uh, little hey hey, he will die. Because I heard something creepy in there. Oops. No, stop it. What's down there? I think I want to take another whack at that. Greenhouse help. We lock the doors of the greenhouse, but this one flies. We don't have long before it figures out the roof isn't covered. Five minutes ago, Edna tried making it into the greenhouse before it took her over. She won't stop screaming, yelling at us to stay back, but if we kill the floating thing that infected her, maybe we can save her. If you find this note, please help. Kill it because we won't ourselves. Rory. Her head exploded. Did she shoot at me? Hmm. 
You know what? I'm actually gonna take a mulligan on that. I'll be right back. All right, did this guy's head pop off? No, he's unconscious. Uh, this person's okay. Doctor, There's another person over to the left. What happened? Where? Oh God! Be Please careful. Tell me you killed that. Yes, yes, I did. I scanned it too. I came up here to deploy the EATs. Okay, he's unconscious. The eradicator too. turrets. Yes. And it was like all the color bled from the world. Everything had an edge to it. I, mm. I couldn't control myself. I. But the EATs are still in the small arms closet nearby. We could still use them. Here's Maybe. the code. I'm going to make my way to the cargo bay. Security was supposed to fall back there. All right. <laughs> Sarah will have my ass if I don't. Well, you be careful. All right, so this place is prone to bug a little bit. Sometimes these people will run at you and their head will explode. Sometimes their heads will just explode anyway. And sometimes Sarah, whatever her face, will remain hostile even after the creature has been killed. Um, I had to play through this a few times before it would actually work. I'm going to head down to Gargo Bay. Don't want to make Sarah mad. Okay. Even if she didn't make it. Can you it, pick up these other unconscious people? to take it out on me. Thanks again. I owe you my life. Well, theoretically, all mind. these people are still alive. This person's still mind controlled. Alright. Now, let's see if we can. Uh... Oh, I can clear it! Sweet! That makes me happy. Wait, that person's no longer controlled either. Wait, theoretically, these people are fine now. Let's take those off. Yeah. You don't need that. Ah, it's gone. Good. Good! Did you find the EATs? I hope they shred those things. Maybe, but we don't really need that right now. Plus, I don't want to use them because, one, they suck, and two, they'll probably start shooting at me. That's below us. We'll be fine. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Water pressure regulator. My kinetic amp. Do I have two of those? Boost damage done by kinetic blast. Yes. I think we already have one of those. Where is that? Yep. Thank you for the duplicate. Well, at least we uh, managed to save the people. That's all right. And their heads didn't explode on me. I don't know why that's a thing. That's kind of silly. They run at you and go... I kind of want to lock these doors and make sure that they're safe. Then again, there is no roof, like they said. Ooh, what are these? Nanas. <laughs> it's like Oblivion! Or Skyrim, or, you know, those types of games. This lady here must think I'm completely and totally insane for picking all the fruit. Ooh, what's this? Yoink! Like, what are you doing? I must have all... Ah, oh, I could have Q-beamed the damn thing. Probably would have made my life easier. Well, oh, these are button doors. Interesting. Wait, it's a button. You can just push the button, right? Whatever. Ooh, tomatoes. These are like free health kits. No, oh, I don't need any health. Excuse me. Ooh, I can upgrade you. I can upgrade you. I'm thinking that this is going to be a good idea to upgrade. Primarily this. That way I can zap people a little bit quicker. Because it seemed to be a little bit slow in the draw and it made it kind of awkward. Alright. A manual of red. Good evening, Talos. This is a reminder that the identity of death. Did they say the identity of death? What is death's identity? He's Richard Cause or something, I don't know. I don't even know who Richard Cause is, I just made that up. Oop. Wait, no, it's not here. It's here! Oh, never mind. I can search that. Oh, I get it. I'm guessing I could grow tomatoes and something broken. Hmm. Now oh, that's a broken turret. Ooh, and a shoot gun. Hmm. My inventory's a little bit full. Yay! 
Resources did I get up that? Is it enough to do something interesting? Ooh, hold on. I don't need these. For a second. <laughs> Alright. I'm gonna make a lot of these. I've returned with many, many neuromods to spare. Well, actually just ten. But that's more than we had before. We could do this. Let's see here. Wrench power, yeah, maybe, I don't know. Hmm. It makes me chuckle, but I feel like there are other things that are more useful. Maybe that is extremely useful and I'm just being dumb. Hmm. Any good powers? <laughs> oh, that's so tempting. It's a let's play, why not? We have to see how these things perform, right? It's all for scientific interest. What? Morgan, that massive Typhon appeared shortly after you installed alien neuromods. Okay. You're being hunted. Uh-oh. Think I may have used too many! The Typhon sense that you are a threat to their ecology have created a nightmare to hunt you. Use stealth or distraction to evade it until it leaves the area, or destroy it if you can. I'll try to destroy it. Or die. That can happen too. Alright, if I can find that nightmare, I will murder it. Or at least try. I have a Q-beam. Slow mo juice. Seriously. You don't want to mess with me. Or maybe you do. There it is. Ah! <laughs> no, you're not getting away from me! Pop! How's that for being a threat? The Nightmare. No entries found. Please contact Dr. Hans Kelstrup, Director of Psychotronics. Morgan's notes. The Typhon responds to an anomaly in their ecology. Something that's not like them, but isn't. Or something that's like them, but isn't. Me. The only response seems to be to hunt me down. Seems unstoppable. Yeah, right. It's weak against psychic powers, but it's immune to EMP and stun. Fear resistance, kinetic blast, and regeneration. Oh. I like regeneration. The Mind Controlled Human. Exert from Transtar Security Records. Incident Report Number 1546-031433. Classification Containment Breach. Reporting Officer Corey Richard. Incident Summary I was on duty at about 14 20 hours when I received a request from Dr. Hans Kelstrop for assistance in live exam. Upon arriving on the scene, I witnessed Dr. Trevor Young slamming lab instruments into some Typhon enclosures. When it became clear that he intended to break containment, I was forced to discharge my stun gun to subdue him. During my subsequent interview with Dr. Young, he seemed immensely distraught and unaware of my presence, unless I came too close, whereupon he turned violent. He has been turned over to the trauma team and placed in quarantine for his and others' safety. Scan data, weakness, glue, null wave, psychic, stun. Could I have thrown a null wave at the, um, at Trevor and, um, cleared his brain? Hmm. I'm not sure. Oh, and I could get Mindjack from scanning them, too. Damn it! 
immunity to EMP. Well, that's not surprising. So, um, how about that nightmare? Wasn't much of a nightmare. Was that the big thing that I saw in the hallway? Typhon Cortexes contain a rich concentration of exotic material which can be used to fabricate neuromods. Ooh, really? Of course I had to make a mess. And I'm the one that has to clean it all up. Oh, my nose is so itchy right now. Ah, oh, ugh. Hey, this reminds me of being in a dome in Planetside. The biodomes? No, anyone? Ah, well. This place is nice. I don't like the glass here, though. I'd be too, cared of, too scared of being struck by a stray meteorite. Oh, man, my nose is insanely itchy right now. Ugh. Oh, there's a shuttle out there. Oh, hello, dead lady. Being dead. That's fine. Hope she's still there. Hey, lady. Just passing through. Maybe you should lock the doors. Be safe, that sort of thing. No? Okay. Hmm. I'm guessing it's a basic, um, phantom that's down there. I'll go say hi in a moment. <laughs> Gonna influence this thing uh, with my hacking abilities that I got from brain chips. I wonder if that thing can occur anywhere or specifically in this region when I install neuromods. Alright. Fix it up. And fortify it. Thank you. These things must be large, or mo might be largely useless, but they provide a bit of a distraction. Oops. That may have caused me. Ah. No, pass through the penis blocks. There we go. There you go. Thank you. You're welcome. What's over here? Gravity Utility Tunnel Loading Bay. Or, oh, 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 I know where this is. Loading Bay Door. Turn the power on, please. Ah, it's open. Ooh, wait a minute. Turn off power. Morgan, I yes? found a satellite project dealing with remote psychotronic signaling. Yeah. RPSS X5. I think I might already have the piece I to that in my office. I think you a neural signature that matches yours. Plain English, you could use it to get that new Typhon off your back. Oh. Latest tech logs show the satellite was damaged, though. You'd have to find a replacement. Yeah, part. I think that's in my office. Hmm. Yeah, that's in my that's in my office. It's kind of far away though, and I don't want to fight the um. The nightmare in zero G. I don't know if I can evade it as much. Hmm. Ooh, I can repair the main lift and go back down to the lobby. Okay. Whoa! Wait, were those things fighting each other? No, those are turrets down there. Whoa! Hmm. That's actually a bit of an issue. <laughs> Look at me doing stuff and pretending to be efficient. I thought I won't be able to hack this. Oh, I did hack it. And you? <laughs> Aha! Done. Oh. Go. Aha! Perfect! Thank you. Yeah, don't worry about it. Material and conclusive. Logging calibrated. 
registration request. Yeah, that happens sometimes. Don't worry about it. Yes. Everything go well. Sometimes. Eventually, Somewhere. had to wait a while. Two assholes from the sales team chose that exact moment to stand under the alarm bell and smoke cigars. Wow, so it's off those tell people. Us. My clients are eager. Yeah, just made the last shipment. Should be Earthside by morning, Pacific oh. time. Good. These people. I'll be leaving another package for you after tomorrow's shift. Drop site? The lobby. Assuming it works. Of course it works. Three taps of the wrench. That'll pop it open. All of them will work that way by tomorrow. You're adorable when you get proud of your gadgets. Don't patronize me, Lily. Hoo-hoo-hoo, <laughs> nasty. Oh, massive frame drop. Why? 